Hi guys, this is Megha Verma. Welcome to my channel. So in today's tutorial, we will learn how to design this Valentine's Day party event ticket in Coral Row. So without any delay, let's get started. So this is the size of our event ticket. Now first we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a rectangle. Now we will set the size of the rectangle 8.5 by 3.5. Now we will set the align of the rectangle. First we will click on specified point and align center horizontally and align center vertically. Now we will select this rectangle and we will drag like this. Now we will right click to make a copy. Now we will set the width of this rectangle 2.5 now we will select both and we will press R to align from the right now we will select this rectangle and we will drag like this now we will select this and we will drag from the top to bottom and we will right click to make a copy again we will make one more copy now we will adjust the height Now we have these 4 rectangles. Now first we will select this rectangle and we will select interactive fill tool from the toolbar. Now we will select fountain fill. Then electrical fountain fill. Now we will set colors. You can see the color codes. Now we will pick the color and we will draw. Now we will select this rectangle, first we will adjust the height. Now we will go to the edit menu and we will select copy properties from. Now we will tick on fill then ok. Now we will copy this gradient. Now we will select this rectangle and we will fill color. Now we will select this and we will fill white color. Now we will select all and we will remove the outline by right click. Now we will select the ellipse tool from the toolbar and we will draw a circle with the control shift key. Now we will adjust the size of the circle. on the left side. Now we will select the common shapes from the toolbar. Now we will select heart shape. Now we will draw heart. Now we will select the rectangle tool and we will draw square. color. Now we will select the ellipse tool and we will draw a small circle. Now we'll fill white color and we will remove the outline. Now we will adjust the size of this small circle. Now we will make copy by drag and right click. Now we will press ctrl R to make more copies. Now we will select all and we will drag and right click. We will create a pattern, dot pattern. Now we'll select all and we will drag and right click then control R to make more copies. So now we have this pattern. Now we'll select this heart and we will make a copy. Now we'll place this on the pattern. Now we'll select the heart shape. Now we'll select the lens tool. We can select the lens from here or we can select from the effects menu also from here. So now we will click on lens option. Now we will select the heart then we will select fish eye option. From here you can decrease or increase the rate. You can see the difference. 
but we will keep 100 now we'll tick on frozen now we'll close this now you can see we have a pattern in heart shape now we'll decrease the size now we'll remove the outline like this we can create many patterns with the rectangle tool or with the ellipse tool so now we have all these patterns now I'll place this heart we will select this heart and we will place here on the center we select both and we will press C to align center now we'll double click now we will match the center point with the circle now we will drag like this rotate and we will right click to make copies like this we will place all hearts one by one and we will make copies we will double click and we will match the center point with the circle and we will rotate and make copies Now we will increase the size of some of the heart. Now we will select this heart and we will make a copy. Now we will match the center point with the heart only. And we will rotate like this. Now again we will make one more copy of this heart. Now we will select all and we will decrease the size. Now we'll match the center point of the heart with the circle and we will rotate and make a copy. Now we'll select the circle and we will press shift page up. Now we'll fill color and we will remove the outline. Now we will adjust the size, we will increase the size. Now we will drag inside with the shift key then right click to make a copy. Now we'll give a color to outline. Now we will increase the size of the outline. select all and again we will adjust the size I will select this rectangle and we will adjust the interactive fill tool we will match the center point with the circle like this now we have all these details now I will place this Now first we will place the company name here on the top and we will give a white color. Now we will place the ticket number on the left side. You 
can see the font style now select all this and we will place on this circle now we'll give a white color Now we we'll select the contour tool from the toolbar and we will apply on this text like this on outer side. Now we we'll right click and we will select break contour apart. Now we'll change the color. Now we will place the other details. Now we will select the ellipse tool and we will draw a oval shape. And we will remove the outline. Now we will place this text. Now we will select all these details and we will place. Now we will change the color. Now we will adjust. Now increase the size of the outline now place this paragraph text now we will place the barcode I will select both and we will press it to align center. Now we will adjust. I will select both and we will increase the size. Now we will place this. I will select both and we will press C to align center now we will adjust all this now we will select all and we will press C to align center now we will drag with the left arrow now we will select the ellipse tool and we will draw a small circle now we will fill white color and we will give a pink outline now we will increase the size of the outline. Now we will adjust the text. We will select the price and we will change the color. Now we will select both and we will set the align vertically. Now we will make a copy of this heart shape now we will decrease the size now we will decrease the outline size now we will drag like this now we will right click to make a copy now we will fill white color now we will select both and we will group by control G now we will make a copy and we will place Now we will select this and we will select the shadow tool from the toolbar and we will apply on this text. Now we will select this text. Now we will select all these text and we will make a copy and we will place here with the right click. Now we will copy this text, we will drag and right click. Now 
I will select both and will press C to align center. Now we will select the shadow tool and we will apply on this oval shape. Now we will select this circle and we will apply shadow. Now we will select this outline circle and we will apply shadow. Now we will select the two point line tool from the toolbar and we will draw a straight line like this. Now first we will give a white color. Now we will increase the size of the outline. Now we will change the style of the line. So guys our event ticket design for Valentine's Day party is ready. I hope you like the design. If you have any question regarding this tutorial you can ask me on the comment box. Please like share and comments and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get updates of my videos. Thanks for watching.